Hi, in today's video I'm going to be teaching you how to do perineal massage using the amazing Perimom. Doing perineal massage from 34 weeks of pregnancy is proven to prevent tearing during childbirth. Tearing is something that many pregnant women worry about. 85% of first time mums and 70% of second time mums will experience a tear of some kind. Some tears are milder, others are more severe and can require stitches, even surgery. Some tears can take a while to recover from after giving birth and it can make sitting down uncomfortable, even painful. So if you're anxious about tearing but you want to be a mum who doesn't tear, perineal massage is what you should be doing at the end of your third trimester. Many women give up on perineal massage because they find it too uncomfortable or too difficult to reach their perineum with their fingers. Baby bumps can really get in the way and many women also feel too embarrassed to ask their partners to do the massage for them. I really struggled with perineal massage when I was pregnant and I wish that I'd had the Perry mum to help me. But thankfully for you ladies, this amazing device has now been invented so you can do perineal massage really easily and comfortably. So the perineum is the bit of skin and muscle tissue which runs from your vaginal opening all the way down to your anus. When you're giving birth to your baby, your vaginal and perineal tissues are stretched considerably and they can often tear. But if you do perineal massage during pregnancy, it helps to stretch those tissues, making them more elasticated and flexible so that they don't tear when you're birthing your baby. The Perimom is a medically approved device which allows you to successfully reach your perineum without stress or strain. It's a very smooth and sleek design. It's made from non-toxic materials and it's also very easy to hold, use and clean. It's designed to be held in your right hand and before using it, you should take off the bottom half of your clothing and position yourself on top of a towel or some tissue paper because you're going to be using oil with the Perimom and you don't want to stain the surface that you're positioned on. Next, Pour about a teaspoon amount of sunflower oil, olive oil or almond oil down the funnel shaped part of the device till it gathers at the bottom here. Next, insert the perimom about 3cm into your vaginal opening like this. Make sure it's in an upright position, then perform a slow U-shaped motion, exerting sideward pressure to the walls of your vagina and downward pressure on your perineal tissues. If you're doing the massage correctly, you should feel a bit of discomfort as you stretch your tissues down there, but the perimom should glide smoothly from side to side. If you feel a lot of friction, you may want to put a bit more oil on the device and reinsert it. Now you can start using the Perimom for five minutes at a time from 34 weeks of pregnancy, but if you want to do it for less time initially, that's okay. And you can just increase the amount of time that you do it as the weeks go by. So in week 34, you could do perineal massage for one minute, three times that week. In week 35, two minutes, three times that week. In week 36, for three minutes, three times that week. Week 37, for four minutes, three times that week. Then in week 38, for five minutes, three times that week. Then you just continue to do perineal massage for five minutes, three times a week until your labor starts. I'm really proud to be an ambassador of this revolutionary device for perineal massage. I only ever endorse maternity products that I truly believe in and think will benefit you. Thanks so much for watching and see you in my next video.